welcome back to the channel. My name is Anna and I am thinking this video is going to get possibly quite heated in the comments. And that is, I'm going to give you some reasons of why women play hard to get. Now, a lot of people can say I'm fed up with women playing games. This is why I want to stay single for the rest of my life. And if you do have that mindset, then this is going to be discussed in the video of why you are not a good catch. So I hope you are ready because we're going to dive in and I can't wait to read the comments. Let's go. So before we begin, I want to give you some psychology about the way that we think. So when you are trying to court a girl, sometimes women know, and I'm sure you understand this as well, that you put on your best self, your best personality, and sometimes you can fake it a little bit. And let's face it, if you are trying to impress her, that doesn't always mean you're showing her your actual personality. So women play these games and play hard to get to try and break away those walls to see if they can figure you out because most women have been burnt by someone who has become amazing at the start of the courting phase and then eventually that false bravado has worn off and she's actually got to see the real person. So this just means that she's looking after herself, she's been burnt before and she wants to make sure that you really are a good catch. So you do not use her. Now, if you were only after her for one reason, and we know what that is, then she hopes that by ignoring you means you would give up the chase and go pester another girl. So if this is at the start of a relationship and she seems to have pulled back and playing hard to get, it's because she's testing you to find out what type of person you are. She is insecure. She feels really good knowing that you are still interested when she goes cold. Now, she might feel that you aren't being so serious so she thinks hmm I will just leave him alone and see if he comes back because let's face it if you are insecure you aren't going to really think someone is attracted to you so she's probably trying to figure out if this is a joke or if someone has set her up. Number three, like we said before, to find out what you are like when you are not attraction driven. So she wants to know, are you going to drop this nice person attitude? Is the mask going to slip? Is she going to find out that you have lied about your job to attract her? Have you lied about your personality so that you guys appear like a perfect couple? This is what she's doing. So she wants to kind of ever so slightly possibly annoy you to see how you react, which ties us in to the next one. If you are toxic, she is testing to see if you are crazy or supportive. Let's say you've had a couple of dates, things are going fine, and then she's gone very cold and she's playing hard to get. She's testing and thinking, okay, so a crazy person right now will constantly ring me and ring me and text and text and they will panic, or maybe they will go into this horrible toxic person who says, I'm not interested in you anymore, blah, 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 or the nice person that she's hoping you are is someone that says, hey, is everything okay? I've not heard from you in a couple of days. I hope things are good. Get back to me when you can. Now she's looking for that response. She wants someone to say, hey, I won't wait around for you constantly, but I am still attracted and hopefully you get back in touch with me. Not someone that gives her 50 missed calls. She is flirting with you. Believe it or not, she's doing this to keep you interested. And let's face it, when a girl plays hard to get, it kind of rattles your brain a little bit, but you are very interested. It makes you think, hmm, what is happening? Do I need to do something more? And she knows what she's doing. She's very, very clever. So remember, she's flirting with you, no matter how frustrating it may feel. She doesn't know how you feel about her. Maybe you have been giving her mixed signals yourself. You've been going playing hard to get or you are emotionally distant. So she will give you some space to see if you come back to her or if you just ignore her and carry on with life. So she is doing this to figure you out. She regrets being too much too soon. 
she may feel that she's invested too much into the relationship so she wants to hold back a little because she maybe feels a little bit embarrassed because she feels that you don't feel the same so she does not want to be caught out dating or potentially having a relationship with someone who doesn't feel the same about her so she's just doing this to protect herself so a way of getting yourself out of this would be to invest in her a little bit more because she thinks wow I really have come across very very strong so up your game a little bit let her know she's interested and she will come out of that playing hard to get shell I promise and lastly a very very important one is she is emotionally manipulative now a lot of guys will say this is all emotional manipulation behavior but let's face it as humans we are very emotionally manipulative to begin with when we're kids we know if we cry the mum comes to us gives us a bottle we know that if we do good in our job we might get a pay rise we know what we're doing but remember this is a human trait but if this girl is someone that is very toxic and you have come across a couple of red flags then it could be she's just doing this to get control so you have to really analyze the whole of the relationship so far and how she responds to you when she does come back with interest to figure out if she is emotionally manipulative now remember that I said at the start of the video that lots of guys will think wow I'm fed up with women because they always play games well that's because she's probably realized that you are a toxic person. So she's pulled away, you've given her toxic spiel, blasted her on social media, told her to, to screw it, basically. And yeah, she thought, well, you know, I've really saved myself because this person was definitely not a catch. So now you should be more mindful of what a girl does. So let me know what you think down in the comments below. And I will see you over in the next video. I really hope that things don't get too heated. And I really hope this has given you some emotional clarity. And I will see you in the next video. Thumbs up and subscribe. See you soon. Bye bye.